in the world. And when we cut to the third and final trivia, or excuse me, commercial break, we asked this trivia question. What was the name of the manager of the Central Perk Coffee House on the TV show Friends? Anybody? Nope. Bleach know. Blonde Guy. The Bleach Blonde Guy. That is correct. His name was Gunther. Oh, that's oh, right. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. And a quick reminder, uh, World Wraps in Cormadera and Santa Clara is still giving our <laughs> listeners a free smoothie with purchase of a wrap or bowl. If you mention the best of investing, go there for lunch today. They have the best wraps in town. Don't forget to mention the best of investing for your free smoothie. Uh, Brian, you were going to ask Randy a question. Yeah, I, I've been to a lot of Kretsu meetings, and I noticed that after each presentation, you always ask the uh, the company presenting, is there any other resources that you need beyond capital? So do you guys not just try to network people with sources of capital, but also try to network them with uh, other things that would be useful for their business? Yeah, so we have a no solicitation policy in Kretsu, so our members know that they are there because they have good hearts, but they're there to give free resources and their Rolodex to help these companies grow. So if a technology company needs introduction to Google or Facebook or AT&T, we're very fortunate, uh, have over 365 members in Northern California, and someone has a resource in any industry that a Kretsu Forum uh, a company that's presenting to us we can we can help our members can help and uh, so I've said that for the last 12 years um, as I MC most of the credit forum is is what do you need besides capital because resources can be um, as powerful or even more effective than capital so what resources can we can we give you free to help your companies grow that's big so how does one join the currency forum Kretsu Forum um, it doesn't advertise, um, and our members bring in members. However, if you don't know about Kretsu Forum, be my guest. Um, just go online and um, um, at kretsuforum.com. And you better spell that out. Yeah, that, I, 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 I spell that wrong every time. Yeah, Kretsu is K E I R E T S U Forum F O R U M. Just like it sounds. And we've been fortunate to fund 302. Great companies over the last um, last twelve years, myself included. Sorry, myself included. Yeah. Yes. How, how much uh, money have, has been raised? Over over two hundred million dollars. Wow. And there was a book written about us uh, that uh, potential members um, can can see that was tracking our first seven years. And if you invested one dollar in the whole portfolio, we've certainly had have had failures. We've had restarts. But on our liquidity events, when this pub this book was published with 50 liquidity events, you'd have a 24% internal rate of return on your money. So we have beaten all indexes in the marketplace because what I said earlier in the show, it's about mindshare, it's about groupthink. And a member that joins Credit Forum, generally she or he um, has had a, a, a great entrepreneurial career themselves or in corporate, but they've had they've had success and they've had significance in their life and they want to come to Credit Forum. You have to be accredited, you have to have a minimum net worth of $1 million to be a member, but they want to not only diversify their portfolio in the early stage uh, arena, but they also want to protect their money. And so we have academies, we have educational platform to educate our members, and we have, again, a six-month rule. We ask you not to invest in these companies because we really want you to take your time. The whole spirit of Kretsu, our membership organization, and how we get paid at Kretsu is it's membership fee. It's a very small fee. It's $3,000 a year. We rely on sponsors and membership fee, but the whole spirit of it is enjoy the swarm intelligence, the group think, to be a smarter, better Investor. Well, the thing I like about it is that you're, you're independent. I mean, you're not specifically sponsoring any of these specific investments. You're just the forum, as the name says, to put it together so that a bunch of people could get together and decide, do I want to invest in this one or this one? I mean, someone it was great because somebody had to put together some kind of forum like this. And well, so you described it perfectly. They're facilitators. They're exactly. Facilitating that's, that's the, word. Uh, the the community of those seeking capital for their startup businesses. And, and facilitating them to be able to meet the vast network of, of individuals well, out there with money who have an interest in getting involved in that type well, of Well, exactly. Think about it for a minute. Let's say I've got a million dollars that I'm thinking about investing, and I don't want to just you know typically go to a stockbroker as an example. I'm sort of interested in these startup type companies. What other kind of avenue is there, right? And generally, uh, if you want to be passive and give a million dollars to a stockbroker, that's totally appropriate. I mean, I, you know, 
90% of my particular uh, uh, capital is in the private, uh, in the public marketplace, but I allocate 10% of my dollars and my wife's and my family money toward invest. I've made 36 investments. I've had eight through currency form. And also what's so powerful about it is people are listening. I don't know how many of you ever been approached by, you know, somebody that wants to give you 50,000, want you to invest 50,000 in an opportunity, but you don't have six people or 100 people to run it by that really truly care that you make a good investment. So the whole spirit, no vested interest. So when you do make an investment, as a credit forum member, 100% of your dollars goes down. Well, when I went to the, the one forum and I saw the people making presentation, there were some very intelligent people in the audience who were asking poignant questions. Not to be, you know, aggressive, but they had very good questions that, you know, the average person would really have said, oh, I wish I would have thought of that. Uh, ahead of time because I don't want to in just invest without knowing. So is there a cost to going to one of your events to no. check it out? It's free and we have a two meeting rule and so please come check it out. If you don't know a member, please be our guest and you can come twice. Um, we limit uh, and uh, dissuade, uh, um, you know, uh, looky lose, but you have to see it for yourself to ascertain if it's benefit for you. But what we compete with is time. You need to have time to look at opportunities in the marketplace. You have time, come enjoy the community. People join Credit Forum because obviously they want to make good investment, take control of their own portfolio, but why they stay is because they build friendships and community within Credit Forum. Randy, really quickly, just give your phone number and then we're going to have to pay. What's your phone number? Uh, it's Credit Forum. Um, and just go online and if you want to if you want to interact with me just go ahead and email me randy at karetsuform.com great all right thoughts for the day why do british people why do british people never sound british when they sing and if you want to know a person's native language ask him to do a math problem out loud he'll always do it in his native tongue Okay, tune in next week to the Best of Investing. We're going to be giving away nine more free vacations for answering trivia questions. Thank you, Randy, for being our guest. Kathy Ireland, if you're listening, thank you for being our guest also. On behalf of our team, I'm Edward Brown, wishing you the best of investing. So long.